go to products. Click the import button and choose product. In this example, we are creating sofas, so choose the appropriate value from the filters. Download the sample Excel file. Let's start entering the details of an orange colored sofa. Type the item code. Choose the brand and category. Write a brief description. Make sure you are not missing any mandatory fields. In the media column, we will add the link of the product image that we have hosted online. Mention the sizes, if any. Enter the MRP and selling price of the sofa. Enter the packaging dimensions. We will look at these three columns later. Trader detail columns are mandatory. Mention the return period, if any. Since we are adding color variants, let's fill the primary color attribute without fail. Similarly, we will create sofas of other colors. Ensure that you keep the name, item code, seller identifier, and primary color unique in the new product. Let's fast forward to addition of two more sofas. Now it's time to add these sofas as variants of each other. Go to the Variant Type column. Choose Additional Colors. Repeat this for other sofas too. Variant Group ID can be anything of your choice. Preferably, you can use any one of the item codes. Please note, all the products that should become variants must carry the same Variant Group ID without fail. Variant media column is where you can enter the swatch image link of the product in that row. These three columns determine which products are variants of each other. Return to find platform and upload the file. After some time, the upload would be completed. Now if you go to any of the sofas, you can scroll down to see the swatch image of the product and its variants. Next, you will have to add the inventory of the sofas you created, either manually or through aggregator or non-aggregator. Mention the seller identifier of each product along with the quantity and prices available at each selling location. Return to Find Platform and upload the inventory file. Once the inventory is updated, you can go to the product page on your website. Here you can see, all the variants are visible to the customer.